name's Murray McCorkdale. Uh, we operate a, a dairy barn in the north part of Oxford County. We just built a new Brightspan robot barn, so we're increasing our herd from about 50 cows to upwards of 100 as quota availability. I farm with my wife and my three children. We currently crop about 280 acres, mostly for our own feed, uh, and we house all our own cattle in the, in the Brightspan. We asked our children if they were interested in continuing on farming, in, especially dairy farming, and because we were limited, we had a 50 cow tie stall, it was an older barn, it had, was needed a lot of work or would, would need a lot of work and we said if they were interested, we were willing to look forward and, and plan something bigger and more technologically advanced than what we had. Initially we were going to just house the, the dairy cattle, then when we did the planning and pricing, it was more economical to build the barn to house everything. Our, our main reason and it didn't come down to price because price-wise it was very similar to being, building a conventional barn. It came down to the environment and the air quality and the brightness that we had in the, in the fabric barns. And on a nice bright sunny day in the winter, this barn actually warms up. Since we've moved in here, we've had, uh, well we're milking more cows, we had more room for them. We In the other barn we were swinging cows, which was a lot of work and not very healthy for the cows because you're putting them to wet box stalls and stuff. In here, we've gone to the compost pack and in the existing barn, we had a lot of strawberry foot rot problems. In here with the compost pack, it actually has helped cure some of the strawberry foot rot problems. We had the hoop trimmer in uh, about two months after we moved in and he wanted to, he wanted to be in earlier because he said we, we had a lot of problems in the old barn. He wanted to get them and we cleared up. So he was in here and we had cut our strawberry foot rot problem by about two-thirds so he was very happy with it and we reduced our how much foot bath we were running he said we don't need to do much because the the compost pack was actually helping heal that on that so just the the extra space the more room for the cattle to move around more comfortable and instead of having most of them tied up in the tie stall all the time they had their ability to roam around lay down and they're very comfortable you can come in here most times in the middle of the day on that and the majority of them are laying on the pack. It's very comfortable for them. And that's helped a lot with uh, a few leg problems and stuff that you had from tie stalls. And even in the hottest days in the summer, uh, it's quite a bit different temperature in here. It's not a whole lot cooler, but it's very comfortable. We had one guy, a uh, salesman come through and he was told me I had to get sprinklers on the cows because it, it was an extremely hot day. It was too hot to stand outside. And he says, your cows will be, and he walked through and our cows are lying comfortable chewing their cuds. And he said he just came from a barn where the cows were panicked.